We are going to visit one of the most beautiful castles in Albania. We've been driving for the past two and a half hour probably. In the mountains. In the mountains, very, very beautiful. We are now in Schroeder. That's our third apartment for this trip, right? Yes, in Schroeder, third location. That's the kitchen. Bathroom. Oh. This is a welcome. Very nice. That's our bedroom. Oh, look. If you guys need another bed, you can hop in with us. <laughs> Lots of towels and blankets. Oh, wow. Well. <laughs> here we can put... Yeah, you don't see anything, but we can put the laundry here. <laughs> this is the only apartment we found that is with washing machine. We had to wash our clothes. Because tomorrow we're going to a very nice place. Yeah, two nice places. Like... Like a really nice castle. <laughs> We just had breakfast and we walk uh, through the city. Looks actually nice. Lots of people are selling stuff on the streets, like handmade stuff or... Yeah, there's a lot of small markets on the street. Super cute, these grandmas. Yeah, also we got some socks from grandmas like handmade socks. We like it more than Tirana, to be honest. Yeah. It's less busy and feels like more alive. Like people are not rushing to work or something. <laughs> and there's a lot of people just, yeah, having fun on the streets, walking, a lot of, lot of shops. We wanted to extend one more night because we're staying here yesterday night and tonight. Tomorrow we're supposed to leave, but I think we're gonna extend one more night because we like it. And we want to explore more of the city. And for now, we're just heading to the castle. Yeah, let's hope it's fun. Dva? Dva. Dva. Do it. Yeah, do it. <laughs> Look at the birds. They're big. So peaceful, right? Yeah. So the tickets were four euros to enter that castle in Škoda. It looks so nice. Along all these mountains, it's so beautiful. What is the name of the castle, my love? <laughs> Rosafa. What these used to be? I don't know. So many rooms. You can see all oh, Schode from here. So that's the city where that's where actually we live. And you can basically see everything here. It looks amazing. But imagine here it was a castle and people and wars and this is where they used to live. That's the kingdom and down there other people used to live that works and pay tax for that castle. Now we pay tax for the government. <laughs> no more castles. Now, um, yeah, you don't have to walk to pay your tax. <laughs> they just uh, take it straight away from your bank. <laughs> Here's the lake. Yeah. And on the other side of the lake is Montenegro. That's another country. Super nice. So the lake is in between two countries. Yeah. This one is what's left. <laughs> Yeah, these are the ruins of the castle. 
Yeah, wow, there is a nice view on the other side. Yeah. Don't even oh. try, baby. <laughs> no, but I'm just trying to understand what was happening here. Well, there's cables there, so the cables used to roll on that thing. So prob most probably it was a door or a uh, Oh, wow. It was first a church and then 15th century, when the city fell to the Ottomans, it became uh, a mosque. So yeah, it was destroyed because of the bombing and the war, Indeed, right? Indeed, yeah. yeah. Let's go. Visitors are forbidden to climb the walls. Yep. So what was this then? Was oh. this the prison? No, no <laughs> maybe. Maybe that was the prison. Then. <laughs> and it's still one. You can't see anything. Yeah, these used to be probably water. Water sources? Oh yeah, there's water here. Yeah, I think this is how they used to collect water from the rain. Well, not destroyed completely. Well, that's the only building that seems like still standing. Oh, there's stairs as well. That that's the highest point. So we have to oh, go there right. and film. Let's go there. Let's check out the house first, because it seems like that's the only house still standing. Here. So that seems like a door of how it was and still. Here's a window. Yeah, but it's still cracked. I'm sure they leave some uh, storage oh. inside. I don't see anything. Me neither, but I wish they just left it as it is, right? A lot of cables, like, it seems like they used <laughs> it to, uh, yeah, put some markets and stuff inside, which is weird. What is there? That's like... Yeah, oh. I'm not gonna dare go inside, it smells awful. Oh, yeah, the smell is already here. Yeah, a lot of uh, pipes and stuff. So this castle is nice, but it's not actually well maintained. But yeah, you I can think see it's garbage just, uh, everywhere. It's but also bombed a lot. I mean, it is bombed a lot, but that's a gate. But it's nice to see like the old stuff that is yeah. still there. I wish also there was a bit more information. Oh, this is closed, so we can't oh. go there. Oh, this is the museum. Yeah. It's 200 left to enter. Yeah. That building that's still there, they made it as a museum now to uh, keep inside what is left. When you first enter, you see the same statue wall, something. Somebody made it from years ago and it's still there in the museum. And that's the only thing that we can see on the paper. <laughs> so, and then you have to pay. Uh, well, it's just two euros. Two euros to enter, but we don't see interest in that. So we're not gonna enter because what's left inside is small stones and stuff. Anyway, that is the third courtyard known as the Citadel. We don't understand what happened here. <laughs> like, they don't know the story themselves, right? Yeah, I mean, I'm sure there is a story, but it's not that you can really find it here. And we didn't really look up too much about the castle, because I think we kind of expected to find all the information here. But yeah. you don't really find the information. It's more like uh, the areas. Too windy. Yeah. Yeah. The area is what it used to be and that's it. And I still, until this point, I don't really get what happened here or what kind of war. Yeah, and who lived here. Yeah, indeed. So that's what I'm kind of missing. I mean, it's, it's nice with amazing views. <laughs> Yeah, it's but, super nice. Yeah, I, I just kind of miss the information part of it. Yeah, I mean, it looks like you needed like a touristic guide here yeah. to tell you about the history of that place because on the board, you don't really understand what is this, what is that, <laughs> and who used to live here, who, 
who came here, who arrived, but who they fought. No. <laughs> and we visited more <laughs> castles, but they all had more information about it, which was super interesting. Yeah. And you really feel yeah. that you are in that place. It's more like an experience. And here I feel more that we're just walking through the ruins of an old castle. And I don't really understand the, the yeah. experience or what it was or the story. Yeah, indeed. What is that? I don't know. You want to go in? No, just going to take a look. Go well, in, have a look. Well, it's it's dark, so <laughs> you can't actually see what's in there. Hello? Hello. <laughs> yeah, it's completely dark. Nothing? Well, there is roots, but it's so dark. So there are basically... Uh, we need lights to see. So there are some tunnels or something. Yeah, well, that's below. the most interesting part in yeah, the whole castle. Yeah, that's what I'm really curious about. Like, what are these tunnels? Yeah, this tunnel Like, seems how did nice. they use them? What are the secret, uh, you know, the secret spots in the castle? Because a castle is always like a maze. There are so many hidden spots and doors and rooms. And yeah, there's a story behind everything. nice historical place but exactly as we said you don't understand anything because on the there's three boards or four boards that explain the whole castle but just what are the sections in the castle yeah and how thick the walls are but that's <laughs> yeah. not really what i'm interested in yeah but there's no more information which is uh, yeah not nice when we were in france we visited one of the best uh castles and yeah Every single room still there, everything was there, like all the old stuff that they used and, and all the information you need to know about it. it. It made it more historical and you feel like, oh yeah, I, I can tell what, what happened here. Really high steps. <gasps> Holy moly. Very nice. <laughs> Almost fell. Oh yeah, look at these kids. So we actually finished the trip now in the castle. It was actually amazing. We just find out that at the door here you can scan barcode for like general information who owned the, the castle by who and when it was occupied and yeah like general information small paragraph about this kind of the whole scene the castle is so nice actually you could yeah. have you could see it obviously from the footage and it's and a great view yeah like, the view is the best this thing, for right? the view it's already worth to visit it we're heading to the next locality by the lake by the lake yeah we're gonna see if it's open because <laughs> we actually want to rent a kayak oh yeah well hopefully because the sun is shining and it looks really nice view. yeah
new friends. Yes. Dogs are everywhere, but they look healthy. Yeah. Any kayak. Yeah, that's. I Everything think is possible. closed, but it's because of the season. Yeah. And then we search for a boat trip, but also nothing. So instead, we're gonna eat. Yeah. <laughs> Which is always a good idea. Oh, friends. We have a whole pack now with us. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> we can give them names. Yeah, so one thing you consider here when you're going to restaurants. <laughs> Some of the restaurants you struggle with uh, that they smoke inside and uh, honestly we don't like that. No, if I'm at a restaurant I just want to enjoy my food and not yeah. smell the smoke all the time. Yeah, indeed. It, it is much nicer and most of the places here are like fish restaurants which here, is nice. Yeah. But uh, yeah, we want something without like uh, smoking inside. <laughs> restaurants have a really nice view yeah. but unfortunately <laughs> the food was a bit less <laughs> yeah the food was not the best and no. we promised to find the best food so this is not no. a recommended restaurant there are lots of restaurants here serving fresh fish yeah this was tomorrow. not fresh i think tomorrow we're gonna try another one yeah indeed and we will recommend it the one that we had before like yesterday night oh. was amazing <laughs> that was really good it was really good especially the, the mixed grill of grill all the meat yeah so good but this guy <laughs> Not so much. No, it was. We ordered some seafood and shrimps. Yeah. And yeah, it was uh, average, I would say. Yeah, maybe 2.5 stars. Yeah. A bit oily, a bit. Uh, everything is dying. Like you lift the potato, <laughs> it's like landing. Oh yeah, the fried potato. Not so were, good. Uh, Look at this amazing <laughs> view. The lake, the water. And the mountains. Maybe the we can go to that boulevard. Do you see this caprice? This is the most underrated chocolate. This is one of the best chocolate. Mm. Can I have a chocolate baby? <laughs> yeah, right. It's finished. It's done. He ate all the chocolates. I destroyed it. <laughs> Within a minute. It was over. Within a second. Look at this beautiful place. Now we're walking by the river. Look at the sun in the back with all the mountains. It's now so we're going to go to that house over there. It's abandoned. It's abandoned house. Try to get some footage. First thing when we saw there that uh, there is like a cage you cannot enter. So uh, like a fence. Yeah. But I think we're going to yeah, hop over the fence and just get it <laughs> because it looks so good so here we go yeah you can jump over that all this seems nice an abandoned house there's painting all over the place a lot of graffiti and look how the view is in here <laughs> yeah let's go up there yeah this looks so oh wow look at this baby yeah, it looks like it was a, probably a restaurant project or something. It didn't continue. Wow. This what looks a nice so, view. So good, yeah. <laughs> yeah, I love the lake and the colors. Yeah. I mean, the sun is setting now very slowly. Yeah. But there is one more stairs to the top. Oh, uh, yeah. Which got, oh my god, look at this. Wow. This is just too much to handle, right? <laughs> yeah, we're at the right time here with the sun setting. Wow. Let's see what the drone is going to show us.
had a lunch at around four. Uh -huh. Yes, we had a lunch at around four, and it was not that great. Yeah. Let's be honest. And it made her hungry so quick, so we had to run again <laughs> for lunch. And it's now it's now five hours later. Five hours. Yeah. Yeah, and. In two years we've been, in one and a half year we've been together, we never ate three times, <laughs> never. No, <laughs> maybe, maybe you're on pregnant. pregnant. <laughs> <laughs> I'm the one who's hungry, and what do you get actually? I got a chicken wings for six euros, and look what I got. I thought that was so small. You thought it was just gonna be a few chicken wings. Yeah, but not like um, there's more than 10 chicken wings and full fries. This is bigger than ours.